new from 88 Films is Snake in the Eagle's Shadow and I've been told to check this one out a while ago from uh, Syaj uh, who always told me that this was going to be a movie that I would love I waited patiently on the Blu-ray to arrive and he was right I love this uh, Yoon Moon Ping directed action here and I'm definitely getting a, a firm grasp on what I like about Jackie Chan movies this was one that I just utterly loved 98 minutes, no fat on it great action set pieces I had uh, the wonderful Simon Yoon um, who was the drunken master back in that weird uh, way he looks just doing awesome action you get Jackie Chan as an orphan who's just playing Chien Fu who kind of works her as the dog's body at this martial arts school the, 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 the kind of man in charge of him who was very familiar I can't place him but I'm sure I've seen him in something else is extremely abusive to him everybody in the school pretty much beats him up but he's a good soul I mean he sees this old man this beggar uh, going about the streets he takes him in feeds him gives him a place to stay turns out this guy is a martial arts master and begins to teach our young orphan in the way of martial arts to defend himself and get a better life for himself uh, and that's kind of like a rough idea of the story but there's other aspects out there as well uh, I've a, a kind of clan war between two factions uh, one trying to wipe out uh, the snake fist which is a beggar's kind of martial arts and now Jackie Chan's martial arts Chen Fu and it just leads to wonderful action set pieces and not even just action set pieces the fight scenes are wonderful they're varied and different but there's just other acrobatic and in incredible sequences that are really fun to watch watching uh, Chan even going about his duties once he's learned a little bit of dexterity and control and athletic ability he is washing the floors and in a recurring scene that we've seen earlier on his master at the time likes to just cause him grief and make a mess of things but Chan is better prepared and as his master tries to stomp his dirty feet all over his clean floor there is a kind of battle with cloths as Chan constantly gets them under his foot no matter where the guy is about to jump to next but of course there is antagonists and there is wonderful antagonists in this and there is wonderful fight scenes within this one I loved a lot of the action that's going on here and it's not always centred around Chan either sometimes it can be uh, Simon Yoon who is doing wonderfully creative stuff fighting several people at once um, it could be um, one of the people within his school fighting another person uh, there are very many fights going on in this one there is, in fact there's not a lot happening in the movie that doesn't lead to another fight or action set piece in one way or another I particularly love a great montage. Is there anything better than that? And there is a wonderful one here uh, of Chan being taught various um, body conditioning exercises uh, while the beggar kind of watches on laughing, uh, forcing him to do cruel and unusual things to strengthen his body. I love these kind of sequences. Yes, you get them in every movie, but you know what? If it ain't broke, don't fix it. And this is a wonderful example of a training montage. When you get to the end fight, it's really well staged within this kind of quarry. So it has these wonderful visuals round about it. I'm used to seeing action being taken on top of a hill with a great big visage, but it feels as if the walls are closing in. You have this wonderful fight scene going on. You've got Jackie Chan with his own martial arts, which is a snake in the eagle's shadow, as it's called. Uh, doing this jump between kind of cat fighting and snake fighting which is it's just wonderful to see and the score and particularly the dub of the uh, action uh, is really fun like you know it's over uh, dramatized movement of hands as it swishes through air the thuds sound great uh, all the sound effects were just terrific in this one and snake in the eagle shadow quickly became one of the better Jackie Chan movies I have seen it's definitely up there it's one that I would 
most definitely put on again to watch. I had a great deal of fun with this movie. Wild, varied and exciting action set pieces, great characters, no over the top in your face silly humour and it's quick and impactful. I'd love to know your thoughts on Snake in the Eagle Shadow. Let me know in the comment box below of this awesome martial arts movie and I will see you next time on Man V Film.